From the author of Spinsterella, a strange and unusual romance comes Spellbound, a darker shade of black. Get Spellbound this Halloween in paperback and ebook and online booksellers everywhere. A lot of people have been asking me to review the Netflix series Luke Cage. Unfortunately, I am not able to review the Netflix series Luke Cage due to financial reasons. As everyone knows, I have been out of work for the past eight years, and because I have been out of work, I cannot afford amenities such as home internet access and Netflix. In order for me to watch a television series such as Luke Cage, Daredevil, or Jessica Jones, and present an objective opinion of what I'm watching, I need home internet access. And home internet access here in the Bronx from Cablevision can cost anywhere from $50 to $100 a month. And in order for me to get that home internet access from Cablevision, I would need to sign a one or a two year agreement. So I would need to be have steady employment for the least one or two years just in order to afford the cable to watch Netflix and to purchase a Netflix subscription. And I would need steady employment in order to not only one, pay for the home internet access, but to pay for the Netflix subscription, which is anywhere from 10 to $12 a month. And right now, I just do not have that type of money to spend on those amenities. And because my income is very limited right now, I just have to focus on two priorities. One, getting full-time employment, and two, trying to advance my writing career and trying to get sales of my books. Those are the two things I'm focusing on right now, and because of that, I'm pouring whatever little resources I get from the limited resource income streams I get, such as my book sales on Amazon and eBay and Google Ad Dollars on those two, on those two priorities. And right now, that's my primary focus. I'm trying to move myself up and get my life together, and that's what I'm trying to do. So for me, I would love to go out here and review the Netflix series Luke Cage, but there are other pressing matters right now. So whenever I do get some money, I do try to do one of two things. Again, I look for full-time employment, and then I try to invest whatever I can into my SJS Direct publications. So whenever I do get a little bit of money from somewhere, I wind up spending money on things like book covers for books such as The Upcoming Spellbound and other books that I have published such as this year's Isis Bride of Dracula. This one cover here alone cost $250. So this is what I invested a lot of my money in um, this spring because I wanted to try to make a power, get a cover that would provide a powerful first impression on readers and I wanted to show everyone how serious I am about building up this SJS Direct imprint and making a lasting impression on readers. So when that's what I spend primarily a lot of the money I get um, from those revenue streams such as Google Ad Dollars and eBay. I reinvest it into things such as book covers for books like Isis Bride of Dracula and the upcoming Spellbound. This, this um, was a stock photo that I modified and I had to purchase and this was um, paid for um, after I asked for a commission from hero business artist Bill Walko. So that's what I pretty much spend my money on right now. Um, in addition to my living expenses which are cut down to the minimum and this is what I, I'm focusing on right now. Now, the reason why I can go out here and review a television series such as an Arrow, a Flash, a Supergirl, and a Legends of Tomorrow is because those television shows come on the CW and are free. But I would love to, again, go out and review the Netflix series, but I have to wait until I get a more steady stream of income from increased book sales or... I wind up getting that full-time job that allows me to return to the workforce and be able to have that steady stream of income that allows me to pay for modern first-world amenities such as a Netflix or home internet access. A lot of people take these resources for granted,
but I understand their value. And this is why I will go out and walk nine blocks all the way to my local public library in order to do things like upload the text and cover for a book like Isis Bride of Dracula or Spellbound. And that's why I go out and walk nine blocks to the library. Without that library, I would not be able to get on the internet here or be able to communicate with you guys or go out here and be able to promote books and look for full-time work. Primarily, the library is the only place I can get internet and it's the only place I can, you know, get internet access. So, in that four or five hours that I am there, I spend, again, my time primarily promoting books, looking for work, and make and posting up these videos. I'm trying to make every effort to get my financial situation correct and again the only way I can do that is with your support so I'm urging everyone who wants me to go out here and review a TV series like a Luke Cage to go out and buy this new novel Spellbound when it comes out this Halloween and to pick up titles that I already have out like Isis Bride of Dracula right now so I need your support if you want me to uh, go out here and buy things like Netflix and home internet access and with those tools I can go out and do other things like make better video reviews of these Netflix shows and pretty much make longer better videos and even go out and do more vlogs like I did for the New York Comic Con now I've thought about doing a Patreon and and I'm thinking about doing that and I'm also thinking about um, asking for more donations through PayPal so I'm trying to find new revenue streams and new ways of trying to make money in addition to my search for full-time work but all I, in order for me to do more things again I need everybody's help because with your support I'm able to increase the quality of my products and go out here and provide you with the videos that you want such as that review of Luke Cage. I'm sorry I'm not able to do that. I'd love to do it, but until my financial situation gets better, I have to focus my limited resources on the things that will help me make more money, not spend money on things that are going to cost me money. 